The property that Gearinghoff selected is located in St. Cloud's Airport Business Park. This is a business park that was opened uh, shortly after 2000 and in 2005 the Donlin Company built that building out there as an expansion of the 88 year old millworking company and they, they worked out there for a long time and in 2011, fall of 2011, they ceased to operate as a result of the impact from the recession and literally about two weeks after uh, the closing was announced and displacement of about 30 employees, uh, Gearinghoff uh, had indicated looking for a building of around 100,000 square feet. Gearinghoff selected us through their broker. They had a local brokerage company that they were working with, Casey O'Malley from INH Commercial, and he was working very closely with them to identify buildings, existing buildings that met their needs in this region. That included buildings in Sauk Rapids and this new state-of-the-art building in St. Cloud. And through that relationship, uh, Casey O'Malley was able to uh, introduce us to the company, give us an opportunity to approach the company and, and show them our strengths and assets and also bring in some of our other partners, including the college and university. Why are we here? Why did we choose St. Cloud? Well, actually, it's the same answer, because of the people. Um, we had so many alternatives, and um, I always have a bad conscience if I talk about it, because uh, lucky me, unlucky him, Joe had to do all the work here and uh, was traveling, I don't know, for weeks, uh, and had to look 60 plus facilities, I think. Um, and he came up with the shortlist, and we came over and, um, and just had a look at it. And uh, we came in, at the end of January, we came to St. Cloud, and we were really, really impressed by the people. Um, how much effort they put in it, how helpful they were. And um, we were even more impressed the weeks and months afterwards because uh, they really, really, um, yeah, they, they really uh, reached out to their promises. They even were more helpful and more supportive after that when we were back in Germany. So from that point on, we, we, we knew, uh, we know where we're going to go. Well, I think what attracted uh, Gearinghoff to St. Cloud was primarily, uh, you know, the, the people in this area. And I think that's what the, their CEO, uh, Daniel, actually said at the press conference. It's the people. And all, all areas of the country have a strong work ethic. Uh, but it goes beyond that. There's a connectedness here and I think Gearinghoff and, and we, we, we put together a group of folks that are all on the same page, all working together from various different backgrounds and a business community that quite frankly in a lot of communities, uh, business communities are used to competing and competing against each other. In this case, the business community is working together to attract other businesses that help the community as a whole. So I think it was the people that uh, were coming together from the educational to the financial institutions to uh, just to other industries in the area, so that's that connectiveness. I would also add to that that uh, the company indicated the strong work, work for, work, workforce, as you had mentioned, but also I think our ability to connect them with the, the diverse supplier network in the state of Minnesota and the St. Cloud region really uh, surprised the company and our outreach efforts there and anticipating that that is one of their critical needs. And uh, through assistance and a partnership with the Minnesota Department of Employment and Economic Development, we were able to connect them with over 65 different companies across the state of Minnesota that they will eventually be doing work with as far as Suck Center, Brainerd, Duluth, and, and that's really exciting because it makes uh, the job creation more than just in St. Cloud. It's the ripple effect that's going to be created here uh, as a result of, of those connections that were made. It's great. Uh, and for us to, in, for us to have an uh, international uh, manufacturer here, I mean, to pick St. Cloud out of all other opportunities around the world, um, and in North America to pick St. Cloud as that site, uh, it really it puts us on the map and gives us an opportunity to create even more opportunities for economic development for other businesses that see St. Cloud as an opportunity to expand.